Ladies and gentlemen, thank you so much for opening this video. I'm Claudia, real estate agent in Jamaica. If you want to sell or buy or build real estate, hit the subscribe button and remember the notification bell. Ladies and gentlemen, this is what it looks like. So this neighbor over here uses his for farming, for cows. Not going too far. We're not going too far. Don't want these cows to run us down. Them have them fence, I can't jump the fence. All right. So the land is undulating. Up, down, up, down. You know, but you have, it has good character. Windsor Forest, the name gives me an idea those of you who could be into ecotourism or you could be into camping or having a real getaway with some farming and campground and tree houses real rustic getaway here Reminds me of my days when I went camping at Moorlands, which was on a big acreage. And we stayed in some camp houses. It reminds me of that very crisp, clean, non polluted property. Call it Virgin Lands. All right, so as you can see, it has a lot of barbed wire fencing, right? Because they're fencing different sections for the cows. Um, what's it called? Paddocks? Yeah. One to another set. Right. Yeah. Yeah. Paddock. Mm. Orange trees. Oh, up the top. Yeah, you can just stretch and pick them, right? They grow a little, but mm -hmm. you know, over here. Mm -hmm. So the road continues all the way around. Also, there's a house right here. Whose house? Oh. Still. Oh, gotcha. So how far does the line go? All the way up? I would imagine. Oh, you used to enter there. Gotcha. Why people? Can't walk out this and I know that already. So anybody interested? We don't have to come. We're doing a four-wheel drive. Oh, you had cane as well. Oh, the sugar, yeah. Oh, so I'm gonna drive along this road and go around. I don't know if it is still good. Good. Well, it's easily established. Back. Oh, he got inside. I'm getting in. Mm -hmm. 
Guava jam. Guava jam. <laughs> One year from Catch the other. We, don't, we never used to buy guava jam. Oh, gotcha. Yeah. It seemed as if it rained yesterday. The ground looks wet, right? Look around there. See, husband find something there. Where did he walk? This was a yam. What are these hills? No, those are Betris heap. You prevent erosion. Oh? From the soil from, the soil from washing away. Yes, so you put the um, oh. heaps. And it's called Bet Betris heap. <laughs> Betris heap. I don't know the correct spelling, so I don't know the correct pronunciation. Oh, okay. Here, so is the stones and pack under that? Yes. Mm-hmm. What kind of tree is this? What's it guango? No, what is he picking? Guava. Oh, oh guava. Hold on there. I'm going to leave bag in the car. I'm going to leave bag in the car. I'm going to have my phone. Some juice with it the other day. Oh, Fully loaded people on the can buy the road, the property just for the guava. <laughs> and a red belly for you know, what's Red belly, look how them big. Woo! Hold on, show that again. Show that again. Wow, <laughs> guys! Red belly. Red belly, nice. Hold on, what we're not even sitting on. Mind the, the mind the cold dodo. Oh, see them on the tree. Oh, see them here coming. But we don't have any bags. That is all your harvest guava. So you see a lot of these trees are on the property. The guava. So yeah, all of these here are guava. Guava, guava. There's one up here to name mountain guava. It's big. Yeah. Bigger than this. Mountain guava. <laughs> <laughs> this is a nice property. What about mango tree though? I love mangoes. I don't see one. Not a mango, Not a mango place. Look, see a guava tree that's in the yeah. So you mostly had guava and oranges, you said. You know something? This could be a guava farm for somebody. And you could also do processing. Yeah. Like it raining, so the may slip. Yeah. Yeah. Into it. Yeah. It's a nice property. Where are the oranges right there? Too far. <laughs> Unless orange is on the tree right now.
Hi everyone, it's Tony. I've taken over camera duty. All right, so this is the land. It's so nice. I think it's 21 acres of land out in Westmoreland. I don't think I can walk this out for you, but let me just show you. So it has different elevations. Goes round and round and round. I'm gonna follow here up to the top of the land. Are we near the end or the middle? This is the end or the middle? Bamboo tree, oh this bamboo tree here. Okay, so ladies and gentlemen, where you see the bamboo tree in the distance right there, that's the end. Okay, so it goes all the way down to the deep corn out there. All right, so that's out this side here. Okay. Oh, there's Aki on here too? Yeah, I love the about three, Aki trees, I I thought we had some more, but only one to get Guava, okay. <laughs> it's nice though, yes. and up this side is cool. Mm -hmm. You own this now, you put part of it in um, to vegetation, I mean, to make a garden, mm -hmm. and another part you plant some fruit trees and some food yeah, to this, eat. It's still nice. I mean, I can see the vision. Right. And down there we have a huge pond. It used to be down there. You see where that tree is? That, that um, what that tree is again, Algi? Cotton, cotton tree. Cotton tree. Mm -hmm. I wonder what's down there now. Years old. Wow. You can't get properties with these um historic trees I get, you know. That is years, years old. The cotton tree, Algi. Down the pond. Down the pond and the cotton tree. I wonder if the pond is still there. The pond is still there, but then I think it's kept. Oh. Follow the road. Follow, Follow the road. road. 
Can you in here? What? Look at the roots on this tree, man. Yeah. You see that oh tree? my goodness. You clean that. That's enough history right there, but I just don't know the age. <laughs> my God. Oh, it's not there anymore. This is a nice tree. You just clear it up and you just create a garden around it. It's nice. You take off all those wild pine. You leave some for the um, decoration. Mm -hmm. Yeah, it's nice. The pond used to be there. I think we'll just put the spring in there. It's a big pond. It was a big, nice pond. Oh. The grass and tell me what you should say, no go talk. Yeah, <laughs> I guess the cows help. Yes, but if we, yeah, at your house, because we had it at our drilling house, uh -huh. and it was like that. So oh. What kind of grass is it? Have it back. <laughs> this is really nice. It is. Says age is no good. <laughs> you okay? Checking if you're okay. Oh, sure, I'm fine. I'm fine. I'm just saying, that age, you know, if, if, if it was if we were younger, okay, it wouldn't be up for any sale at all. Right, you have the energy to, um, yes, wouldn't work it back to what used to. Right here was a house, right here, yeah. A shed, like a cow shed. Mm -hmm. That's where you make the cow. It used to supply um, creamer with milk. With milk. Oh, that's nice. Yeah. Milk cows, wow. But they had a milk cow, you know. <laughs> <laughs> they had to study like this and then the food house and then the big cow. Okay. Yeah. The valley is so nice from here. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Probably. Ladies and gentlemen, there you have it. 21 acres of real estate. Yours for the calling, yours for the planting, yours for the development. We want to hear from you. 876-370-8138 or the office is 906-7174. Bye everyone.